Have you had your hugs today? Welcome, Welcome to Hug Happy! A hug is a form of communication that allows the other person to know beyond a doubt that they matter. Hugs Cafe exudes this sentiment to each customer the moment they walk through the door. Inviting aromas and friendly smiles draw you in and you cannot help but feel welcome in this special place. So much more than the ordinary lunch spot, Hugs is a nonprofit organization that provides food, service training, and employment to adults with special needs. And the food that is made here within these walls is nothing short of amazing. With the menu handcrafted by a team of local chefs possessing decades of experience, you'll find a variety of options to delight any palate. Stop in and try the peach gobbler sandwich, the chicken hug sandwich, or one of their amazing soups or salads. Then finish it off with Hug's signature wedding cake cookies or bourbon peach pies. With so much to choose from, you'll be back again and again. In addition to Hugs Cafe, the owners have expanded their mission into other areas of opportunity, including Hugs Greenhouse and Hugs Prep. These additional ventures provide a place of participation for those who may not feel drawn to working in the restaurant, but want to use their skills in other ways. Hugs Greenhouse grows and sells a variety of perennials and annuals that will thrive in the North Texas weather. Managed and trained by Bill Crump of the Crump's Garden family, the Greenhouse team is sure to succeed. A series of culinary and hospitality classes offered on Mondays, Hugs Prep provides training for culinary independence and job placement assistance for adults with special needs. We're here with Ruth Thompson, founder and visionary of Hugs Cafe located in historic downtown McKinney. Thank you so much for letting us come and meet with you guys today. Thank you for, for, for being here. We are so excited. Um, so tell us a little bit about Hugs and how it came to be. Hugs is here because there is a, a problem with uh, employment for adults with special needs. 82.3% uh, of people who have developmental or intellectual disabilities throughout the country are unemployed. Um, I had a dream two nights in a row back in 2012 of a restaurant that employed adults with special needs. And my husband said, Let, we've got to do it. And amazing. here we are. That is wonderful. So awesome. We've also heard that you have some big news regarding some of your former Hugs Cafe team members. Very exciting news. Our initial vision was that we would train these incredible people, employ them to give them experience, and then they would move on, get a job somewhere else, and we would bring others in. Well, no one has left. <laughs> We've been open for three and a half years and they have found a community. Right. So, so um, you know, we've, we've opened some new programs and things, but very, very recently, Harvest Restaurant, downtown McKinney, has taken on and hired two of our teammates from Hugs. That's so exciting. It is so exciting. They have, they've only been there for about two weeks but they are so excited about having a new opportunity. Uh, but it, it's, it's kind of funny, they were going, but I don't want to leave hugs. <laughs> so, you, you know, it's, it, they have their community yes. here, which they will always have, yes. but now they have a new community at Harvest. That's wonderful. It, it is great. And just right on the other side of the square. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Still close to home. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I love that. That's awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Hi, I'm Lauren Smith, Director of Development for Hugs Cafe. So Lauren, I know that the best way that we can support Hugs Cafe is to come in and eat. But what are some of the other ways the community can support Hugs? Well, the community has already been so awesome with their support, but there really are a number of ways you can get involved. Uh, number one, go to Amazon Smile and search for Hugs Cafe and buy one of those great items on our list. These are direct needs that come from our staff that make supporting Hugs Cafe very easy. We also have a GoFundMe page for our air conditioner that just went out at Hugs Cafe this summer. So to help keep us cool, you can go to our GoFundMe page and contribute to Hugs Cafe and help us buy a new air conditioner for the cafe. Also, feel free to go online where you can find our volunteer application so you can join Hugs Cafe and volunteer and support this great community. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for giving us the opportunities that you have given us 
Dear Lord, we are so very, very blessed, and, and we are blessed to have all of the support that uh, this community gives us. Dear Lord, be with each of us as we do our jobs today, and help us to do them to the absolute best of our abilities. In your name we pray. Amen. 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 Here are the latest housing numbers for Collin County. New listings are down by 9%, but the average sales prices are up by almost 3%. The days on market numbers are up, and buyers are able to be a little bit more picky with their purchases. There are some great opportunities for buyers, but on the selling side, now is the time to reach out to professionals. Staging and marketing your home with an agent who knows the market is so important, and we're ready to help. Call us today and let us know how we can assist you. So what do you prefer? Healthy? or comfort. Comment below for a chance to win this $50 gift card to hug along with one of their customized shirts. Thanks for taking the time to listen. Happy, Happy house hunting! hunting.